17 this morning, a local athlete we've profiled the last several years, taking the next step toward a possible Olympic medal today. Michael Andrew lived and trained in Lawrence during the 2016 Olympic trials. This is video we got of him training way back then. So today he lives in California and today he is swimming in a heat in the men's 200 meter individual medley. We are waiting on the results. It's basically happening right now, so we're going to see how he does. And this is the race he says he's a little nervous for because he has a pretty good shot. While Michael Andrew competes at the Olympics, some local swimmers didn't get that opportunity just yet. But they will try to improve and hope to swim well enough to be chosen for the 2024 Games in Paris. KSHB 41 News reporter Mackenzie Nelson introduces us to the Carl sisters. Avery Carl, the two sisters did not just dive right into the sport. For the first few years, I was like, I don't want to do this. Like, I'd argue with my parents almost every practice. I didn't like it. Like, I didn't want to do it. And then I guess something just clicked, and I've loved it ever since. Abby stuck with it, but Avery stepped away for a few years attempting other sports before returning to the pool. The two said racing was what really drew them into the water. I would beat her sometimes. We just kind of compete back and forth yeah. every time. It's really just, yeah, and it depends on the event, too. Like, I'll always beat her in backstroke, but she'll normally yeah. get me in the 50. It's that competitive spirit that earned the Carls a spot at the Olympic trials. Abby in the 100-meter backstroke and Avery in the 50-meter freestyle style, a first for both swimmers. It was a lot. It was overwhelming, but it was also such a great experience to have and just like see everyone else that's just as good as you like and it was just eye opening. Ahead of the trials, the girls had a busy schedule in the pool and in the weight room for hours each day. It's a lot. It's nice having her there as like a support system just because I know she's going through the same things that I'd be going through, like just different days apart, but it was really nice just having her there and knowing like what I'm going through, what she's going through. We had a very good mutual understanding of like what we wanted to eat or like when we wanted to go to bed, like just based off of race day and stuff like that. Well, they did not move on to the next wave. They are both eager to get back to the Olympic trials once again. I'm ready to go back already. <laughs> I am too. It was so fun. I wanted to race again when it I was It was done. a lot of fun. Next month, Abby is off to the University of Louisville to swim and Avery will be a sophomore at Blue Valley North High School. In Kansas City, Mackenzie Nelson, KSHB 41 News.